Welcome back to my channel. I'm Angie and this is Our Contented Home. In today's video, I'm going to take you along with me as I clean up my booth and add new items and get it ready for the season. It's all cleaned up from Christmas and I want to share it with you. I hope you enjoy. So the first thing I do is go and check out my booth. You can see that several things have sold. I've got empty shelves. Things are on the floor, things are stacked on top of each other, so I need more display pieces. So I did stop by and pick up this table. You can see it's very dirty, so I'll give it a cleaning with half vinegar, half Dawn dish soap. That cleans it up really well. I'll layer it with some of my items so you won't see how rough it is. And sometimes people want to buy these things, so I will put a price tag on this. I also found this piece, which is part of a twin size bed. I think it was the headboard. And I did move that cork board to the back. It was in the front, but I wanted that shelf exposed. So I moved it to the back, cleaned it up a little bit, and it's perfect for the booth. It's thin, it won't take up much room, and it will hold a lot of my items. So I'm excited about this piece, and I can't wait to get it in. So I took the black shelves out and I added this shelf and I'll keep those black shelves, but I wanted to give the booth a fresh look with something new. I start to decorate. This takes me several days of tweaking and adding and I give myself about an hour and a half each day. And so it takes me about three days to get it all done, but I love the process and I always love the finished product when I get through with it. But it's just seeing what fits on the shelves, what looks good together, putting colors together. And this is just something I've learned over the years of owning a booth, but it's like decorating your home. And so I love all the items I have, so it makes it easy to decorate them. And this bookcase could end up being different things. It's just according to what kind of items you have. Mine ended up having a lot of children's items and books and that type thing, toys. And so I added color, which I'm usually neutral, but I had things that had lots of bright colors. So I just went with it on this shelf and it really added something to the booth. And I'm just checking to make sure everything has a price tag. Sometimes they fall off, get pulled off, that kind of thing. And you just wanna make sure your customers can see it plainly because most of the time they don't wanna ask. They just wanna see it and know how much it is. When I'm selling books, I like to stack them on the shelf, but I also like to stack them on top of each other and then add something pretty on top of them. This just adds dimension and layers in your booth. And I also like to put books together, like colors together so that they can buy them as a bundle. I don't have any on this one bundled together, but I do like to do that. And then this was a fun idea. I had these, this little set and nobody bought it. It was in the original box. So I thought it would be fun to just pull them out of the box and stack them in this bowl that, you know, they could be like a bowl filler. And then they would also add color to my booth. So they could buy them and play the game or they could use them as a filler, which I thought was really fun. So here's the table that I cleaned up and added in here. And I added this rug to the top of it to make it a little bit prettier and then baskets on the bottom shelf with pillows in it. And I think it turned out really nice. And then I just added some ironstone and then my acorn, my wine acorn plant markers that I made. And then this old ladder and some cutting boards. I still need to add some things to this and I'll tweak it as the month goes on. And then this bookcase is one of my favorites. It's small and I love the color of it. And I just put all of my ironstone 
on it and I love the neutral look of it. So this is one part of the bookcase and I added little hearts in there. This was before Valentine's Day and this is just to remind you of the season. And then I just add vignettes all the way around and I put these copper pieces together. There's some little hearts for Valentine's Day. And then I just hung them from the knobs on the little table. And then I also stack vertically so that it makes sure I move upward. And that way I can add more things and have more items in my booth for sale. This was an area in my booth that I was excited at how it turned out. I just love these old chippy boards that I find to layer items on top of. And then I love to shred up old music pages and stuff them in vases. And then picnic baskets are so much more fun when you stuff them full of items and your customer comes in and they love to dig in there and see what they can find. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, please consider hitting the subscribe button. And you can also find me on Facebook and Instagram at Our Contented Home. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.